You've been going to Con for a number of years, and uh, it's certainly transformed, hasn't it, from being a creative agency sort of uh, love fest and celebration to something more. Uh, give us sort of a fast forward, if you will, from what it had been to what it is now and where it might be what you expect to see this June. Well, the first time I went, I went as a tag along uh, with my then creative partner, the legendary Steve Frankfurt, who was uh, on the television judges now. Uh, television judges, since television was everything, was about as high as you could go in the creative pegging order. Um, the festival was totally different. It was for creative people. Few account people, mostly from Europe, went. But watching it evolve has been exciting and amazing. And of course, uh, what happened is when the brands and the clients began to see it as something important for them to understand creative, that was the switch that triggered the media companies and the media agencies to come with the clients. What's evolved since then is what I call can-can which is there's the Palais Creative and the speeches, and then there are the hotel suites and the meeting places where the media and agency summits are that are part of the cadence of CES, CAN, Ad Week, et cetera, the tentpole events for major meetings. Uh, in the beginning, they were totally separated. Some of the media people didn't even have tickets to go to the Palais to see the work. But as the awards have expanded, it's gotten much more integrated. And I love that now we're going to have the Innovation Festival, which will bring from the sidelines and the cheap cabanas by the park the platform and ad technology business into the whole mix because the convergence of data technology and creativity and data technology and media and indeed media and creativity uh, is here and I can't wait to see the next set of evolutions when all of those things create again one super powerful can as opposed to siloed can. So in terms of the platforms and these tech stacks and this emergence of big companies um, and smaller companies in the ad tech world with data and decisioning, uh, is it a little bit noisy? Is it a little overwhelming? Is there going to be a winnowing out? Is, you know, where do things stand in terms of this explosion of ad tech? Well, there will clearly be uh, a lot of roadkill in the uh, Lumascape. There are too many individual point solutions uh, in need of aggregation. It's too complicated, so the inevitable consolidation and simplification will occur. Uh, and the big platforms will be a major part of that, especially the open platforms that can accept point solutions as they go. But the shifts are ongoing and the technology is only going to continue to get better. So uh, we're not going to see any change in the importance of ad tech, but we'll, we will see the emergence of bigger, stronger players.